The Cat in the Hat's Learning Library. What cat is that? All about cats. I'm the Cat in the Hat. Let us leave right away to see all the cats we can see in one day. We'll meet lions in Kenya, tigers in Bangkok, snow leopards in China, Siamese down the block. In my kitty cat copter, we'll travel around to all different places where cats can be found. Cats are mammals that have scratchy tongues, padded paws, sensitive whiskers, and very sharp claws. Cats like to chase, pounce, eat, wrestle, and hide. Some cats live indoors, some cats live outside. Here is a fact about cats I did not know before. Some can roar, but can't purr. Some can purr, but can't roar. Tigers are the biggest. They hunt in the night. Most are orange with black stripes and patches of white. Ocelots like this one are cats that are rare. Go to a rainforest, you might find one there. Leopards are strong, and as you can see, a leopard can quickly climb up a tree. Some cats are wild like the ones we just met. A domesticated cat can be kept as a pet. Persians have long fur, and I'd like to mention their long silky coats need a lot of attention. Siamese have short fur, and I can hear now, this kind of cat makes a mournful meow. Do cats like to swim? You may think no way. But Turkish swimming cats like to get wet and play. Cats need to scratch to take care of their paws. When they scratch, they are pulling dead skin off their claws. Cats' claws are strong. Here's another cat fact. Cats' claws can extend. They can also retract. Extend means to push out. Retract means to pull in. Cat's claws pull into sheaths, which are pockets of skin. Cheetah's claws don't retract. They run fast and must grip the ground with their claws so their paws will not slip. Cats have flexible spines. This is one reason why cats can stretch really long or arch their backs high. <coughs> Cats have small collarbones, which can move so cats fit through tall spaces like doors open just a bit. Cats' rear legs are strong, and that's what they need. To catch food, they must run with strength and with speed. Cats need their whiskers and use them each day. Like your fingertips, whiskers help cats find their way. Whiskers help cats know which way they are going, if it's cold out or hot, and which way the wind's blowing. Cats use their whiskers each time they explore. Is this smooth, hard, or rough? Can I fit through this door? Cats can have different markings, stripes, patches, or spots. Some cats have few markings and others have lots. This tiger has black stripes with an orange-red coat, white fur on its belly, chest, muzzle, and throat. This cat is white with colored patches, and that is how I know she is a calico cat. This clouded leopard told me she is proud that each of her spots looks a bit like a cloud. Cats are active at dawn and, active and again at twilight.
For this reason, they see very well in dim light. In dim light, cats' pupils grow round and wide. This lets their eyes get the most light inside. Look at the cat's eyes when the light is bright. Its pupils get narrow, so they let in less light. Cells in back of their eyes reflect light, and so a cat's eyes at night let off a bright glow. Cats have different ears. A Scottish fold cat has his ears that bend and folded and flat. I just met these cats, a boy and a girl. They're American curl cats, and their ears can curl. When a cat hears a noise, its ears turn around, so each ear can focus on one single sound. A cat's nose is wet, and here's one reason why. It picks up smells better than one that is dry. Cats are carnivores, which means they eat meat. They taste sour, bitter, and salty, but cannot taste sweat. Cats have sharp teeth to tear meat and bite. Some use their teeth when they get in a fight. When a cat is upset, it might roar or growl. When a cat is angry, it might start to howl. When a cat is threatened, it might act like this. It arches its back and lets out a loud hiss. A dog wags its tail when it's excited or glad. A cat twitches its tail when it's nervous or mad. Thing one looked up cat words and here is the scoop. What is a clouder? It's cats in a group. When cats rub their cheeks, they leave scent on each other. This tiger cub's leaving her scent on her mother. This lion is rubbing a tree with his face. His scent tells other cats, I have been at this place. When a cat starts to circle and bumps into you, leaving its scent as tar Tarzi likes to do, this is called bunting. Cats do this, you see, as their way of saying, you belong to me. Cats don't bathe or shower, but they have a trick. A cat takes a front paw and gives it a lick. It sweeps the wet paw over its head, and then it takes the same paw and licks it again. Spines on a cat's tongue help it work like a scraper. They're rough and they make the tongue feel like sandpaper. Think too, as a new cat, he's called Mr. Pickles. When he licks you, his tongue is so rough that it tickles. When wild cats have babies, mother cats stay alert to make sure that their little cubs don't get hurt. Mother lion keeps her cubs safe right by her side. They blend in with the grass, and that helps them to hide. A tiger must raise her cubs all alone. In a few years, her cubs will go off on their own. She licks her cubs as a sign of affection. It's her job to find food and give them protection. Now I would like to take you to meet a litter of kittens that live down the street. Born with no teeth and with eyes that are blue, those sweet little kittens are glad to meet you. Newborn kittens are helpless. They depend on their mother. In a few weeks, they'll start to play with each other. What is a Kindle? Hold on to your socks. It's a group of kittens like these in this box. When a cat moves her baby, she carefully holds the skin on its neck where it hangs loose and folds. It won't hurt a kitty to be moved by its mother by the scruff of its neck from one place to another. Mountain Lion and Cougar are names for this cat. So are Puma and Panther. Now how about that? 
kittens grow quickly, and as you see here, a kitten grows into a cat in one year. Cats live just about anywhere that you go. Cities, rainforests, mountains covered in snow. Cats like to sleep, and most cats sleep a lot, on the ground, in a tree, in a warm sunny spot. So now I am sure cats are taking a nap all over the world, and right here, in your lap.